Pathos was written by Fike, Fiona and me back in November 2019. It was our second in-person songwriting session, which I remember vividly. We spent some very beautiful and intense days at Fike's place, working on our music. I love thinking back to these foggy mornings. It feels very magical and special, moments I hold close to my heart. We knew by that time that we still had to write another song to complete our first album, One in the Dark. What we didn't expect was it to happen that fast and fluent. In Twinner we always try to write without any preconceived ideas, so Fiona, speakers and my emotions and feelings would find their way into our music unfiltered. For Pathos, it was a little bit different because I had been having an inner urge to write a song in which Fiona and I would sing as low as somehow possible. And I told the girls about it. And luckily they got excited right away and Pathos was born. This very song is all based on a majestic and dark accordion chords which also opened the song. I find them to be super intense. They are sucking you just right in. An absolute masterpiece of Fike. We based the verses on them, so the really, really low vocal lines. And before we wrote them, we had to try out how low we could go. And this is how we ended up here. When we were lost in the lyrics for Pathos, I had already been pregnant with our little daughter. So the text is dedicated to her. I tried to put into words where our souls come from, that our souls had been connected and tangled, together awaiting to be dragged down to earth long before she would be born. So I imagined a place beyond time, beyond space, where nothing would be important but the love and the bond we had. Fiona came up with the haunting melody for the pre-chorus. It simply stuck in her head and really, it fits the bird so perfectly. We just had to puzzle it into the song. Stop. With the album theme for One in the Dark in our minds, we did not only talk the state of the unborn, but also the process of birth itself. And Fiona then shared a little anecdote with us. When giving birth to her son, she had these kind of daydreams in which she would see huge wheels of time being her servants. With this and the vision of the origin of our souls on our minds, Fiona and I gathered the words for the chorus. And, well, it was probably written in three minutes of time only. Everything was floating. song we write for Twinna, Rafi and Jasper added their parts in the aftermath and I really really love every edition they wrote for Pathos. Back in November 2019 though we were lucky enough to have Jasper in the studio anyway when writing the song. It was super spontaneous but he back then already added lots of the percussion you can hear now.
You might wonder who the singer of the fantastic opera vocals during the long instrumental might be. We have Jessie Joy Sprung guesting here. She's a crazy good opera soprano singer and as Fika's girlfriend, it's double special to have her in this song. Pathos might be the song closest to its very first version. It is definitely one of my favorites on the album, if I may say so. Little note, I think it is the song I have listened to the most, as sometimes it is the only thing that will put my daughter asleep, really, when nothing would calm her down. Pathos does, another reason why this song means so much to me. 